Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rayanne if you are new and today I am going to be starting a new series on my channel and basically what I want to do because I don't see this on any of my huge favorite youtubers channels and basically what I want to do is use and make a look out of every color that I pretty much have in every eyeshadow palette that I have and make a playlist so today for instance I'm using the Too Faced chocolate bar chocolate gold bar palette and I'm using all the I did my whole eye look with just this palette and I'm going to label it the color and what I used so that way you can find it on the playlist okay I have the Too Faced chocolate gold palette and I want this kind of look I want to go and see what kind of look she made with that and just yeah if you, if you get my dress if you understand what I'm saying but that's what I want to do so that's my goal so today is part one of the first series I have so many eyeshadow palettes I'm going to be using all the ones I have different ones that I have and I'm going to be showing you looks that I make with all of those eyeshadow palettes sometimes certain eyeshadow palettes like that are all shimmer I'm going to have to use other eyeshadow palettes with it of course but for the most part I'm going to try to stick to just using this palette alone or whatever palette I'm using in that palette only to make a look so that way you if you have this palette you can create this look and you can find it specifically on my page because I always want that like if I get a new palette and say it's older it's like came out a while back and I want a look on that like I'll go through my favorite youtubers pages and I'll try to find one and I don't know if, what eyeshadow palette they used for one unless I read the description box or I just go through it and I can't find like multiple looks which I kind of hate so I wanted to create this series to basically do that and have a playlist where you can go and you can create looks that I created with each palette. So hopefully other YouTubers start doing that because I think it's a great idea and it would make use for all the palettes that you get and you spend all this money on them, put them to use. So yeah, I'm basically starting this series off with using the Too Faced Chocolate Gold Palette and I created this look and I used green and gold vibes. Basically I used Holla for a dollar and chocolate gold as the main sparkle colors on my eyes. So yeah, if you would like to see how I got this look and using this palette and join me on this series, then please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so you know every time I upload with YouTube's algorithms being crazy, don't forget to hit that notification bell. And yeah, so let's get to the video. Okay, we're gonna start this look off using the Too Faced Chocolate Gold Palette and we're gonna first go in with rolling in dough all over the lid. I did use concealer as an eyelid primer and I'm just setting it with rolling in dough. Next, we are going in with a crease shade. We're going in with So Bougie and we are just going to blend that into our crease. Don't forget to like put your hand towards the middle of the brush to help blend easily. Now you're going to go into Cocoa Truffle, Cocoa Truffle, Cocoa Truffle, and you're also going to add that into the crease. And like I said, put your hand in the middle or towards the end of your brush. And the more you do that, the lighter the shade will be and easier to blend. I sometimes forget to go in the outer corner more. Now we're going to go in with the all over shade and this is going to be Hala for Adala, which is like this greeny gold color. And don't forget to spray your brush first. I always do this and I'm using like a shader brush that's more fluffy and I'm basically just putting it all over my lid. We're going to intensify it more. Don't worry. Next, I am going to take So Bougie again and I'm going in with a fluffy blending brush and I'm just going to basically blend all this out and make sure it's not like a harsh line as you see on my right eye it's harsh on my left not so much I also am using chocolate gold with my finger and I'm going on top this is just to intensify those gold sparkles that are already in the shadow I wanted to intensify it a little more then I took a blending brush I didn't put anything on it and I just kind of blended some more and I also added Holla for a dollar more on my lid to help it stand out. Now we're going to do the outer corner. We're going to go into Cocoa Truffle. You don't have to do this. This is just what I did, so that's why I showed it. 
and it just wasn't dark enough for me so I had to go into decadent which is this black and black intimidates me as you see on my face how I'm like oh my gosh that's way too much <laughs> and so yeah it's kind of hard to blend out that's why black intimidates me but I blended 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 and blended some more and it ended up working out Now I'm going to take my NYX Eye Ink Eyeliner and I'm just going to line my upper lash. Basically this is just for my eyelashes to hide them. That's the only reason why I'm doing this. I usually never show me doing eyeliner on camera. I was so shocked that I did it. As you, can, you can't even see what I'm doing right here. Okay, now we're going to do the inner corner. I'm just going to use the highlight that I used on my face, which is the Becca Perfecto Pop. And I always use whatever highlighter I'm using for the day for my inner corner. It's just what I do. Now I'm going to go into Coco Truffle and we are going to go on the lower lash line. Basically everything we did on top we're kind of doing on the bottom. I just skipped the first shade. Now I am going to go into Decadent again and take a smaller brush and go on the outer third of my lower lash line and just kind of Make it darker. Okay, usually I don't do this, but I wanted to. So I went back in with Holler for a dollar. I did wet my brush before I did this, and I tried to go under my lower lash line to kind of deepen it up. And I'm using more of a, I think this is like an eyeliner brush. Now for lips. I'm going into the Ulta Beauty Lip Liner Pencil in Spice, and I'm just lining my lips and darkening the outer corner of my lips because we're going in with a bunch of shades. I wanted to include my lips in here because I wanted to give you a lip look with the eyes on every look that I'm doing as well, because I like lips. So anyways, I went into Dose of Colors Mint Tea. I don't think they sell this anymore, but this is one of my favorite, these are my favorite shades to mix to get my perfect nude. And I basically use my finger to like pat it out and blend it in. Cause when I use like my lips, it just doesn't work out, but my finger does a great job. Now I want a little more orangey color, so I'm going into more Creamer Please by Dose of Colors. This is the Desi Katie collab, and I'm just kind of putting that on the center and blending it with my finger, and this is making the color more orangey toned. Now I'm going to take the Bare Minerals Gloss, and this is their popular gloss in Brilliant, and it is just like a peachy color, and I love this gloss because it is very comfortable to wear. And that's pretty much what you get. Okay, everyone. So that was this hollow for a dollar and chocolate gold eyeshadow look that I got from my Too Faced Chocolate Gold Bar. This is probably one of my favorite palettes I got. I got it for Christmas and I absolutely really love this palette. I haven't used all the colors, but the colors I have used, I love them and I use this palette all the time. It smells so good. And so yeah, I'm excited to create more looks with this and show you my favorite look. This is one of my favorite looks that I can get from this palette. Thank you so much for joining me on this journey of doing all my palette, eyeshadow palette looks. And I'm excited to start this for you. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you on the next video.